Life Community Services, we are currently serving over 1,500 children each week in George, South Africa. Our goal is to reach the unreached, undeservingly neglected children in a holistic manner through our projects and programming. With an extremely high percentage of child-run families, one of the highest death rates of TB patients, a growing AIDS crisis, the highest per capita alcoholism and the highest per capita divorce rate in the country. These children are in desperate need. Life Community Services Ministry started in 1999 when a church in George, South Africa saw that some children coming in off the street could not concentrate during church services due to lack of nutrition. The church inquired where these children came from and visited their community. An initial center was built that served around 40 children with food, a Bible story, and some English lessons on a Monday and Wednesday. Currently, we minister to underprivileged children and teenagers from age 0 to 18 years old. There are eight centers around the community, and we have several programs. First is the Lighthouse Aftercare, then the Happy Feet Learning Centers, which are daycares where orphaned and vulnerable children are served with love. Next, the Gospel of Jesus Christ program, a skills training, and our nutritional food program. Many of the children that we serve have never attended a church and do not have a biblical foundation. So, every day, when children come to the community center, the daycare preschool program, and or the aftercare program, they start with word, worship, and teaching. The Bible is incorporated into educational lessons and daily activities that improve life skills. Each classroom has a registered teacher who has to make sure that a holistic approach is embraced. We cook for over 1,000 children every day. For many of the children, the food they receive at the center is the only food they receive during the day. The three Happy Feet Learning Centers are there to reach child-headed homes, allowing the older children to go to school knowing their siblings are cared for. We also have other programs that serve children in the community, including discipleship classes, clothing ministry, a garden project teaching children to eat off the land, and a children's choir. To reach children who do not have a stable, healthy living environment, we at Life Community Services strategically began buying up homes in the community through local sponsors and creating Christian foster care homes with the goal of placing children in permanent homes. The incredibly positive results in the lives of children have encouraged us to continue searching for homes. It is our conviction that youth need to be skilled and equipped for the real world. Once the youth leave school, we embark on a skills training project with them. The young men and ladies are skilled in gardening and maintenance, while some other young ladies are skilled in a sustainable development project, where they sew, knit, and crochet. The products are then sold at a local market, a small overseas market, and individually to people who visit the ministry. This part of the ministry is called Isipo, which is the Zosa word for gift. It gives a sense of self-worth to the people working in the sustainable project while they are gaining marketable skills as well as entrepreneurial skills. We believe that each person has a specific plan laid out by the Lord for their lives, and some need direction to find it. Within the skills program, the young people have found purpose and skills to equip them for employment. Through our 70-plus staff, we identify needs by building relationships in the community through home visits. Many of our staff members raise support or get funding through grants. At Life Community Services, we believe that by reaching the next generation, we can make a positive impact on the community of George and give children hope for their future.